Now in this part we've got to now find the speed of the rocket three seconds after it's left the ground. So that's the speed up here. Well, let's just put that in, okay, as an arrow, and we'll call that V. It's going at V meters per second at that particular point. Now, from the first part of the question, we found out that the acceleration of the rocket through this stage was 6 meters per second. So we can put that in as 6 meters per second. So how are we going to find V? Well, it's again going to be a typical SUVAT type question. So I'm going to nominate upwards as positive. I'm going to write in S, U, V, A and T. And what have we got? Well, we've got S being 27 meters. Okay. U is zero. V we want. The acceleration is 6 meters per second per second and the time was 3 seconds. So in fact we've got quite a lot of equations that we could actually use to work out V. I mean we've got V equals U plus AT. We've got V squared equals U squared plus 2AS. Uh, we got S equals u plus v times t all divided by 2 or we've even got s equals vt minus a half a t squared okay so which one do you use well that's up to you but i would have thought the easiest one is to use v equals u plus a t so that's what i'm going to do so just say using v equals u plus a t what have we got? Well, we got V equals U at 0 plus A at 6 and the time is 3 seconds. So therefore, quite simply, V equals 18. So therefore, the rocket is going at 18 meters per second in an upwards direction after 3 seconds. And that brings us now to the end of this part of the question.